moving into a new place isn't supposed to look like this. Three weeks after moving to this home and monument, Jamie Bunting still doesn't have her things. No idea when they'll arrive, so she contacted Denver 7 for help. Good evening. Welcome to Denver 7 News at 10. I'm Shannon Ogden. And I'm Jessica Porter. Thanks for joining us. Bunting isn't the only one upset with Alliance moving in storage right now. As Denver 7 Sloan Dickey reports, a new class action suit, though, could bring a sense of justice to hundreds of families. A new empty home. Supposed to be my dream home. A new right. frustrated couple waiting. This would be our living area. Um, where our couch, sofa, and, you know, entertaining things should go. For their furniture. And we had to buy some cheap, uh, basically, camping chairs and our deluxe air bed box table. <laughs> yeah, so this is how we're living, and it's how we've been living since July 1st with no um, delivery date in sight. But it's the same company, Alliance Moving and Storage, that this family is frustrated with. The same company we shared with you in May with other customers alleging similar misconduct. They've made my life a living hell. They still said we are going to be with you every step of the way from the time the movers come till the time, you know, they deliver it. Um, and not one of those things has been accurate. Jamie Bunting has paid Alliance $14,000 to move her family's belongings from Indianapolis to Monument. Our medals, our kids' pictures, um, all that kind of stuff. It's all at, at an unknown location right now. Their belongings were picked up on June 16th. They still don't know when their furniture will arrive. They advertise, you know, 24-7, you know, quality customer service, which they didn't provide. So we called the owner of Alliance Moving and Storage to get some answers and were greeted home, with the if, same tone you know, of voice that Bunting says she received. But I'm going to promise you this, you post another fake news article on my company or my name and how hard we work inside of this industry, you will be sued and so will you lose your job. We still didn't get an answer as to when Bunting's belongings will be delivered. But on Tuesday, an attorney filed a class action lawsuit against Alliance Moving and Storage on behalf of hundreds of potential clients. The lawsuit alleges the company used fraudulent advertising and business tactics to lure clients and take their money. We think there's a lot of victims out there of Alliance Moving and Storage. We think they've been doing this for a couple of years now. The lawsuit is open to anyone who used Alliance Moving and Storage in the past three years and believes they were taken advantage of. These interstate moving companies are definitely supposed to tell you where all of your items are being held if, if they end up storing them. So by not disclosing that information, that's illegal. By holding it as a cash ransom, second of all, we're looking at as theft. While we were interviewing Bunting, the owner of Alliance Moving and Storage did call us back. And after some hostility, it's because you're standing in a news station saying that we have your furniture hostage when in fact you took free storage. That's the only difference I'm getting at. It is not. It is not. No, it's not. You are holding. You are holding it hostage. He did apologize. I appreciate you because you know what? You brought something into my eyes that I haven't been able to see because I've been working so hard on everything else. So. Well, thank you very much. Now she hopes. Where's my stuff? Yeah, that's 100%. That's all I care about. They will, for once, stick to their word. It has been the worst experience of my life. And Contact Denver 7 will stay on top of this to make sure those belongings are delivered. Sloan Dickey, Denver 7.